The seventh question says, find the equation of a line drawn perpendicular to the line this through the point where it meets the y-axis. This is given in terms of intercept form, yes? And x-intercept is 4, y-intercept is 6. We can easily write the x-intercept and y-intercept. x-intercept is the point where the line meets the x-axis. y-intercept is the point where the line meets the y-axis. Yes, that's what the person is talking about. So let's draw the actual diagram. No rough sketches this time. This is the actual diagram. This point is 4. This point is 6. Okay, x-intercept is 4, y-intercept is 6. This is the line x by 4 plus y by 6 is equal to 1. Now, find the equation of a line drawn perpendicular to the line this through the point where it meets the y-axis. So, which line are you looking forward to? Now, we are looking forward to this particular line over here which is perpendicular to this line at this particular point. Okay, this particular point is 0, 6. Let's call this B. This particular point is 4, 0. Let's call this A. And we are actually looking forward to this particular line L. Finding the equation of this particular line L. So for L, what all do we know? So we know that this L is passing through this particular point 0, 6. That's one of the conditions. And the other condition is given in terms of slope. If this slope is M2, this slope is M1, then we know that M1 times M2 is equal to minus 1. And what is M1 is equal to? What is M1 equal to first of all? Let's take a look at the value of M1 from this equation of line. So for finding M1, let's write the line in terms of point slope form. Although you can use another idea, what is that? Minus coefficient of x upon coefficient of y. That is also there, but let's use the general approach. x by 4 plus y by 6 equals 1 gives me y by 6 is equal to minus x by 4 plus 1 which tells me x equals multiply by 6 this becomes minus 3 by 2 x plus 6 okay this is not x this is actually y y equals this therefore m1 is equal to minus 3 by 2 which tells me m2 will be equal to 2 by 3 the slope of line l is 2 by 3 and it passes through the point 0 comma 6 that's what i can guess over there and since it passes through the point and point is 0 comma 6 so let's use the point slope form what is that equation of l can be written in point slope form which is y minus y1 m times x minus x1 this is the form that i can use what does this form tell me y minus 6 is equal to slope 2 by 3 times x minus 0 this is what you have or y equals 2 by 3x plus 6 in the form y is equal to mx plus c you can directly observe that if you get the slope this is nothing but y is equal to mx plus c form and yes that's the answer in that particular form of this required line the equation of the required line. this is the seventh question for us